Do you need a checkout feature for your Canva website? Stick around, I'm about to get into the tea. On this channel we spill the tea on technology on social media so today we are going to be talking about how you can build a cart or a checkout for your free canva website go ahead and get into this tutorial let's go just go up to your search bar and type in squareup.com then you're gonna click on get started now you're gonna create your account. Go ahead and type in the email address that you want to use for your SquareUp account. After you've done that, create your password, click on I agree and press continue. Now your account has been created. Now they want you to tell them a little bit about your business. So my business is called Makeover Marie and then you're gonna put your expected amount of money that you want to earn and then select it's a mobile business. Now you're gonna use this drop down menu to give them a little bit more description of your type of business. You can scroll through here and just see what best fits your type of business that you have. I'm gonna select consulting and hit continue. Now, where will you sell? So, my business is mostly an online business, but you can select any of these choices that they have here. After you've done that, select continue. Now, how will you take payments? What else can they help you manage? If you have payroll and things like that, if you wanna create an item catalog, you can do that at this point, but I won't be doing that in this video. I'm just gonna scroll through and show you what you can do. And then after that, we're just gonna go back up and we're gonna press skip for now. You can always go back to this. Now it says you can start taking payments. Let's continue. Of course, they wanna verify your identity. So you're gonna put in all of your information and I won't show you all of mine. So we'll just hit continue and skip to the next portion. Now, where do we wanna send the process sales? So you need to make a choice here, free square checking, next business or same day. So I have chosen the next day transfer, which is free. And then I'm just going to press on continue. But these are the other options that they have as well. I haven't tried any of them, so don't ask me about those. Okay, now you need to link your bank account that you want your deposits to go to. And after you fill in this information, you're just going to click on continue and it'll go to the next page. What kind of hardware are you interested in? They have two different types. You guys can choose the type that you want, but as you can see, it comes with a free reader as well. So I won't be choosing any of these because I'm just gonna choose to get the free one. So you just press skip if you just want the free one. And then it'll say, where do you want, what do you want to set up first? And I am going to just choose the online option and then hit continue. You can create your branded website on SquareUp if you like. I have done that as well and I can show you a tutorial of that later on. But for now, we just wanna be able to, to create an online link um, for our Canva website. So I'm gonna show you how we're gonna do that. Down and you can see Okay, if you scroll down, you can see about all how you can make um, the website. And we're just gonna use the free monthly plan and just get started. You can choose an experience that works best for you. And I'm choosing the full website. And once you get to this portion, you are going to click on the three lines at the top 
left side of your page. Then you're going to select the online checkout button. Okay, from here, we're going to click on create a link. Now we want to click on sell an item. And in this portion, you're going to describe the item. You're going to give it a title and then you can put some optional information in the second box. You're going to give it a price as well. After we have filled in all of those um, informative pieces, it's going to give the, you the option to upload a photo so that you can know when you go back to all of your links, which product is linked to what. So you can go ahead and upload a photo and create link. It's so easy to do. Now that we've done that, let's go back over to our website. Website, this is one that I have, um, for the most part, finished creating. And now we're going to use this last page to put our ebook information on i'm just adding text here do your makeup like a pro and then you just resize it and make sure that you're using the same fonts that you've used throughout your whole website theme and then i went over to my uploads and then i grabbed my ebook covers and now i'm just gonna add text by just typing in the letter t um, and it'll just put up some text for you so you can change it to what you need it to be. And I'm putting in the fact that it's an ebook. I'm putting the price. And I'm also going to put in um, one more element. And that's going to be for the actual button. Um, at first, I chose <laughs> this square. But then I said, hey, let me check to see um what type of buttons i've used throughout i used an oval so i just go up and grab the oval that i've already used um so i'm gonna use the same item so that the website looks cohesive and i'm just going to duplicate it and add my shop now button on top or my buy now button All right now that that's done now let's get to Lincoln. Okay, so highlight the buy now, click on the link. And I just went back to my square up shop and just copied the link and I'm placing the link in here and just press enter. You also not only want to do the words, but you want to do the button as well. So just cl click on the button and then add the link to the actual button as well so if someone clicks on it it'll work for the button and it'll work for the text now the only thing left to do is to publish your website so you're going to go to the top and click on publish website you're going to click on continue and then at the bottom it'll say publish again and then it'll say preparing your design now we're just gonna visit the website to make sure that the buttons actually work. So we'll scroll down to the last page. There's our eBooks and let's click buy now. Let's see what happens. Okay, boom. Now your customer is able to check out just like that. All right, so I hope you're ready to add up your dollar signs i hope this tutorial was quick and easy for you to do if you guys have any questions please make sure you comment below and don't forget to like comment and subscribe to see other videos just like this i'll be dishing the tea every monday and wednesday all right till next time make sure you show up for yourself bye